Ooh, look what I got. In case you don't know, this is a Black Widow rear basket. Or that. Here you have it, um, all nice and wrapped up. I'll take it off of the plastic. Okay, so after a little bit of persuasion with the uh, five pound hammer, I finally got it in there. Um, I think that's normal, because um, it's it, it makes sense, because it's got to latch onto something. I mean, right now it's pretty sturdy as it is, but uh, it came with mounting bolts. Some people said that it didn't come with mounting bolts. Mine did. Now, even though the current crisis that's going on, this is made in China. I'm sorry, but when you guys say to buy American, uh, there's very few companies that are made in American. And I would love to see after this COVID crisis is over, we start bringing American stuff back. For now, this is what we have. Um, it works very well. It adds, well, let me get a measuring tape. See, I bought this because I first was looking at a box, but it adds, if I can get the measuring tape out, almost another foot. So, per the mounting instructions, what you do is you take... They come with these U-bolt uh, carriers, and there's racks on my ATV. And what'll happen is it should theoretically, and then what you do is you put the uh, plate over it, and it sits on there. And then you pretty much just well. I think they're, they are a little bit big, but I don't think it's that, that big of a problem. Because I don't believe they come with different, I think these are all, well, now I can't get it off. It looks like they're all one size that they come with. Yeah, they're all one size. So, pretty much just put it in the bottom of the basket. And then it just bolts right on, which I kind of want mine somewhat towards the outside. And if I can get my fingers out of the way. You're gonna have to go the other way with the clamp. Like this. Yeah, that's cool. I was gonna say I got a Dremel. I'll, <laughs> I'll Dremel it off. So, finished product. Now the instruction manuals. Um, I guess I did do this bottom. So why? What I don't get is is that see how. Oh, so you have two options. You have two options. You can do it with the knobs on the top or knobs on the bottom. I did it with knobs on the bottom, so that way you got a flat deck. Now, I only use three because what I noticed is is that this wire, if you mount it to, like, let's say here, um, it will cave it in. Whereas if you hit it in the middle, get this seated, put one bracket there, one bracket over there. Okay, so here it is on 
I don't know about you guys, but I kind of wish they made a bar that goes across there. That would be mint. But I only used the um, three brackets because what happens is if you start mounting to this mesh, it pulls it in. And I don't think that's very sturdy. I think what's more sturdy is pounding this down, putting the brackets where these beams are. So there's one, there's two, and then there's a third one in the middle. And I think that'll be very sturdy. Um, and I got an extra, I got an extra one in case I need ever need it. So thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe. Catch you in the next one.